Hi, I'm Jordan Wayne. <laughs> Listen. Silence, soothing to the ears, but not the soul. It's uncontested dark origins. Go back far and old, long past Moses and his sea. Silence reign past Socrates, Aristotle, and Epimenides. Down through the great valley of kings, silence shot up into the sky. Back before planetary establishments and mosaics of stars. Through the ever-expanding space, but backtrack in a time lapse to start back where it all cracked in one big bang. And with that boom, came a beat. And from that beat was born a man. This man was no superhuman spirit. He couldn't fly or read minds, nor did he have a four-digit IQ, but he could feel. He could feel the pulse of the rhythm ripping waves up his fingers to his arms, using the back beat on his backbone. This man stepped on one green on two, not a three blink on four, and as an infant, he didn't kick or scream, just bounced, shook his hips, and grooved on the floor. And the first words that spilled out of that young boy's mouth flowed out in melodies that rocked his poor mother's extremities, making her sway back and forth until she slipped into a subconscious snoop. And as that boy grew older, so did his spirit with great leaps, who soon learned that his blood, flesh, and bones were only structural tones in his bodily overture. His new great symphony shattered boundaries, bound me with sound, he found common ground to set free. What was he truly made of? He felt the beat. And as his friend spat dip, he spat rhymes with lips pressed tight, he locked himself away, losing sense of time, for presence and mind he wandered. And when reality finally stepped in, it picked him up and dropped him into a beatbox barren wasteland, a place this man could stand or live in. And his spirituality was no longer determined by commandments, but guided through electromagnetic wavelengths. He sensed them, bowed his head, and praised to the cosmic gods through megahertz and FMs. And he was clear, and without knowing what not needed to be done, his rhythm seized heart, unclamped, made room, and pulled a fast one. And he found a lover, and with immediate touch to her hand, the heartbeats harmonized, sinking their neural pathways to a beat of one never undone, he found love. And back by the Bible, they didn't hesitate to procreate. With interlocking legs, his heart beat like a bass drum, thrusting like a metronome at 104 beats per minute. He made sure that child came out on time. And he made that beat. And with a newborn baby boy, it didn't take long to see that pulse echo through his body, down his feet, and to the floor, he was a dancer. Like father, like son, that rock steady beat carried through the two of them as one. And as he watched that boy grow up, time had its toll. And it didn't take long before he had wrinkled skin, so knees hunched back and a weathered soul, the man was old. The lifetime of living had stumped a fat groove in his rhythm, and one day singing, he lay down, looked up, and finishing the song in a whisper, he fell silent.